So, for today, ayun nga, ito lang. Uh, lesson natin is derivatives of trigonometric function. Bago tayo, mag, bago tayo mag-start sa mismong derivatives, uh, konting background lang muna sa relationship sa mga trigonometric functions natin. Technically, we have six trigo functions. Okay, so... So, we have six trigo functions. We have the sine, cosine, cosine, tangent, uh, cosecant, okay, second, and then cotangent, okay. So, yun yung anim. So, technically, itong anim na to, mayroon silang relationship or relations between sa kanilang, tat, sa kanilang anim. Malamang. Okay? So, pakita natin kung ano yun. Okay? Teka. First, draw muna tayo ng uh, hexagon. Okay? Next, uh, gawa tayo ng mga diagonal lines. Basically. And then, this one. Ayan. So, hindi siya maayos. Next, sulat natin. So, we have here as ng kulay. Sine, cosine, cotangent, cosecant and then second and then tangent so ta we so ayan yung sa six vertices natin and in the middle we have what we call the number 1 okay so number 1 yan so gamit tong hexagon na to guys technically we can find basic yung mga basic trigo identities natin okay first identities na we have is yung Pythagorean identities. So, ano nga yung Pythagorean identities dito? Ito yung mga Pythagorean identities na meron tayo. Lahat ng mga inverted triangle. So, first, this one. So, next, this one. So, yung parang, ano, uh, danger sign ng biohazard. And then, lastly, this one. So, yang yang tatlong Pythagorean identity, yang tatlong inverted triangle na yan, it consists the three the Pythagorean identities na meron tayo. Okay? So, talaga. Pythagorean identities. So, ayan. So, yan nga, di ba? So, Pythagorean identities first. So, siya sabi dito, sa hexagon natin, guys, yung apex ng inverted triangle natin is equal to the squares, to the sum of the squares ng dalawang base. So, what do I mean by that? So, ganito siya. Magiging sine squared theta. So, dalawang base natin, sine and cosine, plus cosine squared theta is equal to 1, and so on. So, ganun din. So, tan squared theta plus 1 is equal to second squared theta. And then lastly, 1 plus cotangent squared theta is equal to cosecant squared 
theta. Okay, so type ko naman dito ano yung mga abbreviation nila. Sine, cos, tan, para alam nyo lang din. Cosecant, secant, and then cotant. So, ayan yung mga yun. So, ayan yung first set of identities natin. Next, we have the ratio identity. Itong ratio identity naman, girls, technically, uh, dalawa lang siya, which is this one. Okay, so, sinasabi dito na yung two adjacent uh, ident function, hindi ko pa to explain, pero ganito siya. Ayan. So, ito. So, sinasabi dito, guys, yung yan, tsaka ito. Wait lang. Tsaka ito pa. So, lahat ng mga outside triangle, okay, kikreate siya ng, uh, tawag doon, ratio identity na tinatawag. So, makita nga lang doon. So, first, pinaka-classic. So, ratio identity. Okay. So, ratio identity. First, we have uh, tan theta is equals to sine over cosine. And then, cotangent theta is equals to over Ayan, lag. Calls to cosine theta over sine theta. And then, maroon pa tayong dalawa. Tan theta is equals to Ah, uh, second theta over cos second theta, and then last cotangent theta is equals to uh, cos second theta over second theta. Okay, so yun yung another set of identities natin. So ratio identities, pala. Lastly, is we have, technically, pwede natin siyang itawagin na reciprocal or reciprocating identity. Something like that. So, ganito siya. Yung reciprocating identity natin, guys, is yung tawag natin, uh, yung diagonal. Lahat ng diagonal na meron tayo. So, ito, sine, cosecant. So, ayan. And then, cosine, second. And then, lastly, cotangent. Tangent. So, dadaan siya dito. So, sabihin niya, guys. So, ito siya. Reciprocating. So, let's say na identity. First, we have the sine theta. Sabi dyan, sine theta is equals to 1 over cosecant theta and vice versa. So, cosecant theta is equals to 1 over sine theta, and so on. Okay? So, cosine theta, 1 over second theta, then second theta is equals to 1 over cosine theta. Then lastly, uh, tan theta is equals to 1 over 
cotangent theta and then cotangent theta is equals to 1 over tan theta. Okay, so yan yung mga set of identities na meron tayo. So technically, uh, konti lang yan. Actually, madami pa. Pero dahil nakafocus tayo sa hexagon, yan na lang yung mga ituturo ko. some of them, hindi uh, nyo na siya need, unnecessary details na siya. Diba? So, why bother teaching it? Kaya. Okay? Pero ayan, at least may, base, may, may foundation kayo ng identities na meron tayo. Ayan. So, start tayo for examples. So, ayan yung mga meron tayo. So first, uh, ano bang purpose ko ba siya tinuro? Nagdag lesson. <laughs> okay. Pero ayan, other than that, uh, for the sake lang na ano, ma-challenge, first objective, bakit ko siya tinuro? First and last, is yun nga, why bother teaching math? Diba? Technically, math is all about how you find solutions in every problem. So, something like this. So, dito, ganun din. Ang idea nito, Although usable siya in some field, pero in our field, technically, we have uh, the technologies to do it naman na. Pero ayun nga, ang purpose, ba't ko tinuro to sa, sa ano natin is, tawag doon, ba-challenge kayo kung paano nang solve yung certain problem. Okay, so, yun nga, we have many solutions as, what I'm, uh, as long as it is mathe mathematically correct. Okay, so, katulad ang sabi ko sa inyo, as long as, Tama naman yung solution nyo, di ba? Ba't hindi ko ito tama? Kung tama naman. So, yun nga yung point. Yung point out nito. So, first, let's, kunwari, let's have this one. Okay? So, let's try this one. So, this one. Okay, first example tayo. So, ito, itong example 1 na to. Technically, it have, it has two exam, ah, de, one lang pala. One lang. Pero, let's try. Ba, may makita kayo. Okay, tan theta plus, ay, tan theta sine theta plus cosine theta is equals to second theta. Okay. So, prove, proven na to. Proven na, na yan. Tan, sin, theta, tan theta, sin theta, plus cosine theta is equal to second theta. Proven na yan. So, let's find a way how to prove. Paano natin siya mapuprove na na? Okay? So, proving. Parang proving yung idea nitong topic na to. So, first. So, pag ganito guys. Uh, we can classify. So, may equal sign tayo dito. Nasa left ng equal sign. Of course, left yon or left hand side side okay so we call it lhs and then of course yung nasa right it's right hand side so dito mamimili kayo kung ano yung kaalikutin niyo kung ano yung i i, i ano niyo i so solve something like that so syempre in uh, certain things like this technically ang kino solve natin is yung komplikado mas complex sa nila kasi as is yung itong yung yung simple so dahil proving siya dapat either yung left or yung right yung either yung left or yung right yung ma-prove niyo na kapareha nung kabila vice versa technically yung guguluhin niyo is yung mas mahirap kasi maayos na yung nasa kabilang side parang ganun yung idea so we have here tan we have here the tan theta sin theta plus cosine theta okay so, ayan. So, we have here. So, ayan. Tan theta, sin theta, plus cosine theta, second theta. So, first, ang gawin natin is, i-ano natin to. So, i-simpli... Ang gawin natin, of course, is i-simplify natin itong tan theta, sin theta, plus cosine theta, into second theta. Okay? So, doable naman siya. So, ganito ang mangyayari. So, magiging, itong tan theta natin, balik tayo sa mga ratio, sa identity natin. We have here, the ratio identity. Okay? So, ayan. So, sabi dito, tan theta is equals to sin theta plus cosine theta. Ba natin gawin ganyan? Okay? So, pakita natin. Kung sabi ko sa inyo guys, madaming way to solve this one. Pero, ayan, hanapin nila kung paano. Okay? So, tan theta... 
is equals to sin theta over cosine theta. So, substitute natin ito ngayon sa equation. So, magiging sin theta sin theta all over cosine theta plus cosine theta is equals to second theta. Okay? Magiging ganyan na siya, di ba? So, next, so, I, uh, sim so, next natin gagawin is itong nasa left hand side natin. So, technically, left hand side lang yung solve natin. Itong left hand side natin is pagsasama natin siya yung one fraction. Okay? So, magiging sine theta squared plus so, ano lang naman to Basic mat lang naman to guys. All over cosine theta. Okay? So, ayun. So, multiply ko lang to dito and then, yun na. Okay? So, para ka lang nag, ano ng LCD. Okay? Tapos, next natin guys, is kung napapansin nyo yung sa taas, kung napapansin nyo, yung taas na yan is magiging ano siya, magiging Pythagorean identity, di ba? So, we have the Pythagorean identity here. Sin, sin squared theta plus cosine squared theta is equals to 1. So, magiging 1 over cosine theta is equals to second theta, which is sa reciprocal identity natin. Okay? So, ayan. So, correct siya. Okay? So, na-prove na natin ngayon na second na tan theta, sin theta. Ayan. Is equal to second theta. Technically, may other way to solve pa naman to. Pero, yeah, try natin hanapin. Baka makita natin. Okay? So, ayan. Let's try. So, magiging ganto. Let's. Sabi natin. Gawin natin. So, now. So, another solution tayo. Let's try to convert cosine theta into... Ano ba? As, ah, tama. Convert natin ito to sine theta. Ah, to 1 over second pala. Just ganun. So, ayan. So, tan theta sine theta plus 1 over second theta. Di ba? is equals to second theta. Okay? Next. So, ayan na siya. So, next, magiging uh, second theta. Before natin gawin yan. Second theta sine theta over cosine theta. Tapos, sine theta plus 1 all over second theta is equals to second theta. Okay, so technically, another way to solve mga ganito is reduce them into sine cosine. Okay, yun yung pinakamadali, yun yung isa sa mga pinakamadaling gawin. I-reduce yung sine to sine cosine. So next, magiging ito, magiging, uh, ito convert natin to 1 over cosine. So magiging 1 Wait lang. Sorry. So, magiging ano to? Uh, 1 over cosine. Tama, di ba? Cosine theta. Sine theta. Over cosine theta. Sine theta. Plus 1. Over second. So, mangyari dyan. Mas mag-technically magiging... Ah, uh, ikas ko na. Magiging sine squared theta over cosine squared theta. Kasi so, multiply to, Multiply yung sa baba plus 1, all over second theta is equals to second theta. So, baka ito, itong sin, sin squared theta, magiging tangent, tangent squared theta siya. Okay? So, mangyayari sa problem natin, is magiging ganito na siya. Magiging tan squared theta plus 1 is equals to over second theta. Second theta. Actually, ayan, pwede nyo ito, pwede nyo i-move to dito. So, pag binove nyo siya dyan, magiging, magiging squared na to, di ba? Magiging squared na siya. 
So, ito na siya. Tan squared theta plus 1 is equals to second squared theta. So, equal siya. Or pwede nyo gawin, i-convert nyo muna ito sa so, magiging second squared theta over second theta. Second theta. And then, cancel out. So, magiging second theta is equal to second theta. So, mapapansin nyo guys, technically, ang pinapoint out ko lang naman dito is uh, madaming way to solve identities. Okay? As long as tama yung ginagawa ninyo. Okay? So, yan yung sa number 1 natin. So, next tayo. Proceed tayo sa next example. So, ito. Let's try this one. Pwede nyo din itry. Kung nakopya nyo yung page 1, much better. Para pwede nyo ako sabayan mag-solve. Okay? So, number 2. We have here, 1 over tan theta plus tan theta fully is equals to 1 over sin theta cosine theta. Okay, so we have this equation here. Okay? So, try natin siya ngayon solve Okay? So, ganito siya. First, convert natin muna ito into cot cotangent. So, ito magiging Either way, kayo bala kung anong gusto nyo unang isolve. Diba? Doon sabi ko sa inyo, pwede nyo unahin ito sa kaliwa, pwede nyo unahin sa kanan. Pero, sure ako magkakama up yan in one way. Okay? So, pakita na natin. So, ito magiging 1. Ay, then. So, magiging cotangent theta plus tan theta is equals to is it nga, 1 over sin theta cosine theta. Okay? So, ito magiging So, balik tayo sa ratio identity. Ayan, di ba? So, pwede gamitin yung sine cosine. Kasi technically, kinapakita mo dito kung ano yung kailangan sa kabila, which is sine tsaka cosine. So, magiging ito, magiging sine, ay baliktad. Magiging cosine theta over sine theta plus sine theta over cosine theta. Okay, so next is combine uh, dissimilar fraction. So, pati siya ikaw combine. LCD siya, guys. Magiging least common denominator. So, magiging ganito siya. Cosine squared theta over sine theta cosine theta plus sine squared theta over sine theta cosine theta. So, pagkasama nyo na lang siya. Okay, so, LCD yan, ha? Wag, I hope medyo may idea kayo sa LCD. Okay, so, ganyan yung idea niya. So, ayan. So, dahil same, same, same denominator na, guys, pwede nga siya pagsama ngayon. So, magiging sine squared theta plus cosine squared theta all over sine theta cosine theta. So, ayan na siya. So, makapansin nyo, guys, yung sa numerator natin, technically, is a Pythagorean identity. Okay? So, ayan. So, ayan siya. So, solve natin. So, gamit natin siya ngayon. So, picture na natin siya. So, equals to 1 to, di ba? So, magiging 1 over sine theta, cosine theta, is equal to 1 over sine theta, cosine theta. Okay? So, kita nyo. So, technically, na convert natin siya into 1 over sine theta, cosine theta. Okay? So, we have another set of solution naman dito. So, pakita din natin. Okay. So, ito naman yung another set of solution natin, guys. Which is, so, so, lang ulit natin. 1 over tan theta plus theta. Technically, what we can do here is, pwede siyang gawin as, actually, uh, pwede siyang gawin pagsama natin ito agad. So, mag LCD na naman tayo. So, LCD is tan theta. So, magiging 1 plus tan squared theta all over tan theta. Okay? So, next, yung taas is Pythagorean identity ulit, which is equal to second squared theta. So, baguhin natin sa taas. So, magiging 
second squared theta all over tan theta. Okay? So, next. Ito, gawin natin siyang 1 over cosine squared. So, magiging 1 over cosine squared theta all over yung tangent. Convert natin siya into cosine sine over sine over cosine. Di ba? Sine theta over cosine theta. So, ayan. So, so, next is, naturo ko rin naman to paano mag-multiply, paano mag-combine ng mixed fraction. Okay? So, ayan. So, magiging ha, cosine theta all over sine theta cosine squared theta. And then, cancel out. So, matitira is 1 over sine sine theta cosine theta equals to 1 over sine theta cos theta. Okay? So, <clears throat> last. Bale, di mo tayo last. So, I'll give you an exa, ano, uh, activity bago mag-end tong ano na to. So, papasagot ang otso sa inyo. Para i-try nyo lang din. Okay? So, try this one. So, sine, sorry, sine cube theta is equal to, so, para tayo lang, para siya mag-equal, okay? So, sine theta minus sine theta cosine squared theta. So, para tayo nyo, paano siya mag-equal, Okay? Okay, so, ayan. Let's solve this one. So, magiging, magiging ganito siya. Sine theta, 1 minus cosine squared theta. Okay, so, magiging sine theta. So, ano lang yan? Uh, Pythagorean identity. So, sine squared theta. Okay, so, and then, finally, is equals to sine cubed theta. Okay, so, don't forget, mag ano nung quiz okay so ayun lang guys uh